Hi, I'm Tony and welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about the Nolan N87 Plus helmet which costs £229.99. Nolan's N87 helmet has become really popular since they launched it. It's won a whole host of magazine group tests and awards across Europe, and customers love it too. It was so successful that Nolan have released a deluxe version with a little bit more of a premium feel, a little bit higher price tag, and that's the Nolan N87 Plus that you see here. So this helmet has emergency release cheek pads, it has plusher linings, than the normal N87. There's a level of adjustability for that lining as well, so it can suit different head shapes. And then there are also improvements to the lining in terms of the breathability. There's more mesh on the inside to help keep the rider cool. So let's go into a bit more detail about the helmet. A lot of it is shared with the straight N87. It's the same polycarbonate shell with three stage venting, one at the chin, and then twin vents at the top allow cooling air to flow through just above the visor there with a permanently open exhaust vent at the back to extract the warm air that could cause you discomfort while you're riding. The visor is a quick release and it's easy to change and simplicity is also up on this helmet because the Pinlock MaxVision insert comes already fitted. Most helmets that comes in the box and you need to fit it yourself. With this helmet it's already on there so you've saved yourself that task it lifts from this central tab, which can be used just to lift it slightly to allow a small amount of air inside. And it also firmly locks it down in place to try and stop any inadvertent opening as you're riding along. There's an internal sun visor, which is quite, a, quite common across Nolan helmets, operates on this switch on the side. And this one is also stepped, which is quite unusual. So as you go through, there's, there are different gradients that allow you to decide how far down you want the sun visor to extend. Another thing about the N87 sun visor, it's the same whether you've got the N87 or the N87 Plus, it's anti-fog. There's built-in capacity for an optional Nolan Encom Bluetooth system that would slot in place along the side rim of the helmet here. There are also pockets inside the helmet where a foam tab can be taken out to make room for a pair of speakers so they're not putting pressure on your ears. Though lots of people who've bought N87s and N87 Pluses both point out that you don't have to buy Nolan's dedicated intercom. A more general Bluetooth system will fit on this helmet. Approval wise, as well as the general road approval ECE 2205, it's ACU Gold approved for use on track or in racing. We'd say this helmet is really designed as a road helmet, but if you're an occasional track user then you have the standard you need to be able to take this helmet on track. Weight wise, this helmet weighs in at 1585 grams, which we would say is average for a helmet of this class, particularly with a polycarbonate shell. It's not the lightest helmet, but nor is it by any stretch of the imagination the heaviest. Switching to the interior, that's where we find the benefits of the N87 Plus over the straight N87 helmet. The fabric covering the liner is plusher, a little bit softer, with a more premium feel. There's also more mesh within the lining, which helps with keeping your head cool while you're riding along. The strap is fastened by a micrometric buckle, which is in common with a lot of entry level helmets, but the materials on this one are a level above most that uses quite a good amount of steel on the clasp here. It has a much more premium feel than a plastic clasp that you would get on a cheaper helmet. It also has a chin curtain here to reduce draft and chill inside the helmet. The idea is it also reduces noise. So a lot of reviewers say it's noisy. I wore one of these helmets for a trip to Germany a couple of years ago, and as an earplug wearer, I found that it was fine. Not a problem. If you wear earplugs, I don't see this being an issue. But if you are someone who refuses, then be prepared for this to be a little bit noisier than normal. I hope that gives you a really complete picture of the Nolan N87 Plus helmet. If there's anything you feel we've missed, please pop your question in the comments below and we'll do our best to get back to you with an answer as soon as we can. Thanks for watching. 